Hey everyone, Morgan here. A little late night review here. Well, not really a review, more like an overview and impressions and I don't know. I'm not really good at knife reviews, but I really wanted to do this. I realized that I have not done um, an actual review of this knife that I've been carrying for over a year. Uh, I got this knife first when um, I... It's beautiful out here, so I was just listening. It, it just rained today, like, really hard, and it smelled amazing out here. Okay. It always smells great after a rain. So, anyway, um, this is the Gerber Flat Iron, and I'm just going to do a quick little overview and just talk about my impressions about how I've been using it for over a year. I've had this in my pocket since Mother's Day of 2019 which is over a year ago. It's July of 2020. And um, I've been talking about it on Instagram and sh I show it in pictures quite a bit. So let's just dive in and look at it. This is a G10 composite handle um, and it, it is frame locked. So here we go. There you go. So it does lock into place, which is pretty nice. It's a frame lock there. So this is a cleaver. I don't know what it is about cleavers, uh, cleaver knives, but I just love the look of it. And to have it like a pocket knife cleaver is, is just really cool to me. I, I just don't know what it is about it. I just, I, I freaking love it. So as you can see there, I actually opened it with one hand. Um, I like to close it with two hands, but this, this is pretty easy to open with one hand, um, as you can see just a second ago. Uh, so, you know, opening it with one hand, not a big deal. I do like that, uh, the thumb hole for that very purpose. Um, <clears throat> you know, it does stay pretty sharp. Uh, we sharpen it often, but it does stay pretty sharp. Now, I will say that, you know, I mean, this fits really, really good in my pocket. It's a very deep carry. As you can see, it's a deep carry, which is, is which is really nice. Um, you know, a lot of people really like that deep carry. All that you can see is just this little bit of top part and that I really do like that. The clip is amazing. It is freaking strong. You know, to get this in and out of my pocket is, it's not a struggle, but you can tell that it's on there tight, right? So that, it's really good. It's a great, it's never loosened up. I've never had to re-tighten it. So the clip is great. And the fact that it's a deep carry uh, pocket uh, clip is also a big plus. So I think uh, my the biggest flaw that I have is actually this handle. As you can see, it's actually gotten a little discolored. When I used to wear jeans, um, I was wearing jeans for a while uh, before I was wearing the 511 um, Defender pants, and it got a little discolored from the jeans, and it kind of just kind of, you know, like I can clean it a little bit, but it gets very discolored kind of very quickly and it just kind of stays like that it gets kind of stained so this is definitely a knife that you really want to you know pay attention to and clean on on that handle but I would say that's my only complaint about it is that it kind of stains but I don't really care I like that knives look used I like that knives you know they don't they look like they live in a pocket or that they you know that they are a pocket carry right I mean that's that's the whole point so I'm not like you know this is not going to deter me from ever recommending this because I highly, highly recommend this knife. It's a great knife. The overall blade length is 3.8 inches. So it's a, you know, it's a big blade. <laughs> it's a big blade. Uh, it can pretty much take care of anything you need. And one thing that I really like that I look for in, in my knives is the fact that I can use this for just kind of everyday tasks of opening boxes or cutting straws or do whatever I need to do, as well as using this for outdoor purposes. And I could definitely use this for outdoor purposes. So this is just my kind of overview and um, impressions after using it for over a year. I actually really highly recommend this knife and I know that this is a terrible knife review, but I'm not a knife reviewer, you know, I don't, I'm not, you know, I'm not weighing the knife. I'm not, uh, you know, I'm not gonna, I don't show like a lot of that very technical stuff, you know, and I'm really sorry that this is not like a very high tech, you know, special, uh, you know, um, knife review. This is kind of a terrible knife review, I think, but uh, th I have literally been wearing this for over a year and I just wanted to tell you guys my impressions of it after a year wearing it for over a year. 
And at this point, I am actually looking at the uh, at several other knives, but um, Gerber came out with a Gerber Ayako that I really want to get my hands on for actually about the same price. I got this actually for around, I think it was around $35 and I think it's about $42 now. So I'll put a link down below to where you can actually go check out this knife on Amazon. And um, overall though, you know, with actual use of you using this often, not often, but you know, using it as much as you use your everyday carry knives, you know, for various purposes, I'm very, very happy with it, especially for a folder. Um, you know, it, it locks in the place nice. It's the clip is great. Um, I'm actually very happy with this knife overall. So thank you all so much for watching. Conquer tomorrow, preparing today. I'll talk to you later. Bye.